I got into Elgoro through Cal. So as always, they lead the way. <laughs> um, when I was doing my little code base review for them, I picked up a random PR. It had a bounty attached to it. Um, a week later, I ended up getting paid. It was pretty cool because, you know, instead of doing, well, not necessarily work for free, but the work that I was going to do anyway, um, I was able to get paid and it gives you that really nice feeling like, you know, that you feel rewarded, um, you know, that you feel appreciated. So the moment we had funding and everything else, I said, you know, if we're going to take open source contributors, we should consider how we're going to do bounties and more specifically tips. I was also hoping to ask you for a quick demo of uh, the Kimenso. Yeah, I mean, just before we jump into the demo, I do want to reiterate that we honestly love Elgora. And even outside of like from a company perspective, on a personal note, I think seeing this change in sustainable open source is like, it's a massive thing. And it goes both ways. So we as, you know, commercial uh, products that are open source, we can tip our contributors and create sustainability that way, which helps develop a more thriving community. And for us, you know, community is the most important path to adoption because we need to build trust. And what better way to do that than to reward the developers that might go back and then promote us to their companies. But also for like uh, larger open source projects like Nuxt and such, uh, if they have like a feature that they need to do, people can tip it or bounty it as well. And the maintainers can pick that up and it helps them avoid like a whole bunch of then like annoying, creating a statement of work, going and approaching mm -hmm. you know, whatever large client that actually wants it and then doing it to their meet. Instead, they can start crowdfunding it all through uh, bounties for specific features, which lets you avoid GitHub sponsors where some people will leave it on. It'll be like $5 and it might be a bit, but they'll usually churn after a couple months. Instead, this, you know, a hundred, 200, $500 attached to a specific piece of work that you can get done. Someone else might come in and add to it with the most recent, uh, prettier thing where I think $25,000 went through to the winner. <laughs> so yeah, seeing that instead of like people having to go and solicit contributions from like, you know, larger companies is really amazing. We are absolute fans of Elgora. We can't wait to see what comes in the next year as well.